My name is George Iceman Gervin. Uh, this is Dylan Brooks. What's up? This is Vince Carter. You're listening to the Three Point Conversion. Check it out. Hey, and what what are you seeing defensively right now that has made it harder for you guys to string stops together against them? Uh, they make tough shots. Uh, going into that third, I think the second quarter hurt us. At the end of the second quarter, it started off with me a uh, stupid turnover. But um, I think we gave ourselves plenty of chances to win that game tonight. We just um, made a few mistakes. Is this the kind of team that is just going to capitalize on any little mistake that you make? How do you yeah. kind of make sure that you're clean and precise? I mean, they got the best player in the world, so. And he's got the ball the entire game. So anytime you make a mistake, he sees it. So, I mean, it's hard to beat that. <laughs> Anthony, did you you uh, have any words with uh, Jamal or any of the uh, Nuggets at the end of the game there? It looked like you Oh, yeah, yeah. Something. I just told his ass, um, that's what we, we love that. Keep keep talking that. That's what we like. Well, I love it, you know. So, you know, he ain't say nothing back, but I'm pretty sure he heard me. They heard me. Yeah, we live for that. Anthony, how do you um, how do you sleep after games like this? Like how how do you sleep after game t- game three and this, the games like this, especially when I mean the same that I sleep after the first two games. It's no different. This is a series. I mean, we won two games, but we didn't think it was gonna be easy. I mean, this is like I always say. These are the defend. I said it after game two. They're not gonna lay down. Um, they're gonna punch, and we're gonna punch back. And um, and they beat us up tonight. The last two nights they beat us up um, in the fight. And um, that's okay. You know, we'll be all right. We'll bounce back. Figure it out next game. And we'll be ready again. What was the biggest difference for you individually tonight versus game three? No difference. I was just aggressive tonight. Yeah. Game three, I, I only took like 14 shots. Yeah. Which is not myself. And it's a just now it's a three game series. Like, how do you kind of, you know, kind of avoid the ebbs and flows, you know, flying high after two and oh, and then and then dropping two here? Like, how do you keep an even keel and go into it knowing that? Your two wins away. Um, I don't know. Yeah, that's a good question. I don't know. Um, I don't. The last time it was two or two, I think it was Memphis series, and that didn't go well for us. So I think we gotta do some, some different that we did last time. And did you notice something defensively with them that enabled you, no matter who was on you, that you could get to the basket, you could get your shots off? Was it something that you saw maybe in film in the first three games that you capitalized on tonight? Um. No, I think I was just aggressive, man. Yeah, I think that was the main thing. I didn't let it stop me. How do you – Carl was struggling early. I think he missed, like, his first seven or eight shots. As a he teammate, did. do you encourage him? Do you want him to keep being aggressive? Do you want him to let the sort of game come to him? How do you sort of encourage him through that? Uh, I mean, he's a superstar. Mm-hmm. He get paid to put the ball in the rim, so I always tell him, don't you never, don't you ever stop shooting the ball because you miss five or six shots. I don't give a damn. We need you. We need to. In order for us to win, we need you to score. And I'm just happy he was aggressive the entire night. Like we, that's a win for us tonight. Him being aggressive throughout, having an off night, I guess. The last thing, you were guarding Jamal. You were guarding Jokic. There was a point in the fourth quarter. I think it was nine minutes left. Mm-hmm. You just looked tired. You yeah. called for a timeout. Like. How do you conserve your energy while still playing with energy when you're out there for 40 plus minutes? Uh, I got to figure it out. Um, I'm young, so you know I guess I can be t- look tired and still be effective out there. Um, but yeah, I definitely was a little tired, a little gas. I mean, but I'll be all right. Any other questions for you? All right, uh, you guys had the series, uh, you know, up to. And then you had a few games to, I mean, a few days to. Kind of try to be patient and you know, get back to playing. And now uh, Denver has the momentum of the series, you know, winning two in a row. Uh, what's the difference, you know, having to turn around and play right away back in Denver? I like it. Um, I think the three days hurt us actually. Yeah, I think having those after those two day after those two wins, um, they gave us like three days off of, or three days before we play again, and I don't really like that at all. But um, I think that's why we came out sluggish game three. Um, but I don't I don't think they got any momentum. I mean, they won I, we won two games, they won two games. At this point it's just whoever wins two games. So I don't know how people look at it, but I, I look at it like I'm I'm happy. I'm ready it's we're competing at the highest level and um I'm smiling about it because I'm happy, I'm ready to go play. If we play tomorrow, I'll be ready. So 
It's gonna be fun.